Get out of here, demo play. Alright, this is Mystic Square. Another of the Toho games, and frick, hold on a second. Okay, had to, um, had to get this stuff open. Let me reset this. There, back to what we are supposed to be at. Here's the prologue to the game. Deep in the mountains of an eastern land, the Hakure, 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 the Hakure Shrine was a little peaceful. Speaking of the Hakure Shrine, there is the Shrine Maiden, Rimu Hakure. Hakure? Oh well. Who isn't so carefree at the moment? If you must ask why, it is because there's a constant flow of demons, although not too much, appearing from their own world, Makai. Thus, Rimu is obligated to constantly exterminate them, constantly leaving no time for herself. It's been a little strange lately. I can't move the silver, so I can't read it. Lately. That was Rimu. Since Rimu felt something strange was occurring, it would be her duty to investigate it. And so she searched for the source of the demons. Eventually, Rimu discovered that the demons appeared from the cave in which the door to Makai is said to be. Yes, that's it. Which has existed since ancient times in the mountains behind the shrines. Behind the shrine. Rimu was again speaking. This is the place. No point in endlessly bashing small fry. I've got to ram through the front gate and show the ringleader who's boss. Marissa Kirasame, who was observing this. Here's Marissa speaking. Hmm, Makai, huh? That sounds fun. Marissa decided to take a little tourism trip, and behind Rimu's back, made haste to Makai. Oh yeah, how am I supposed to get in? That's Marissa again, speaking. Meanwhile, <laughs> tell me. <laughs> Two of the residents of the human world, Mima, the evil spirit, and Yuka, the yokai, aren't too happy about the fact that demons have bought have barged their way into the human world. Those snobby Makai demons, this is Mima speaking, those snobby Makai demons, don't they know that the human world is mine? Yuka, this is Yuka speaking, seems exciting, exciting, I've always wanted to go to Makai. Not sure exactly why, but the two headed for Makai themselves. Yeah. And that's the prologue to the game. This is uh, Mystic Square, Toho Project 5, last one made on the PC, uh, 60, whatever. That thing. <laughs> so, we're gonna play it. You have the choice between playing Rimu, uh, Marissa, Mima, or Yuka. Rimu uses the same sh uh, uses the same attack type that she used last game, last game being Lotus Land Story. Marissa uses, uh, kind of like the attack type from Eastern Wonderland, Story of Eastern Wonderland, uh, I think. She's, there's some, like, twist to it, though. She's, it's... No, she uses, she uses her second type from Story of Eastern Wonderland, I think. That sounds... Or, not Story... Lotus Land Story. Um, sorry. Mima uses uh, more of an attack type from Story of Eastern Wonderland. Yuka uses the, mo the mobile type from Story of Eastern Wonderland. Alright, that's Yuka. She's the boss from Lotus Land Story. She's the boss... Mima's the boss from, uh, from Eastern Wonderland. Marissa served as the sub... As, like, the fourth stage boss for both. And Rimu, obviously, is always the protagonist. Uh, Yuka appears in later games. Mima, this is her final appearance. And these two obviously appear in numerous games after this. It's kind of a bummer that Mima's final appearance is this, because Mima's actually kind of cool. Uh, she's... A, she's in... Onkyo? Onkyo? Whatever that, whatever that evil, evil, vengeful spirit is in Japanese folklore. It's someone who's died but comes back for vengeance. It's about all there is to it. That's what she is. It's hinted at in uh, number three, Phantasmagoria of Dim Dream, when she tries to explain that she's not dead but she's not alive, and it'll be hinted at later on in this level. I've already played this game a couple of times. I've run through as Mima. I, I came very. I, I got to the final boss, and uh, he totally jacked me. He said, Nope. Well, she said, Nope, and instant killed me. I got to the final boss as Rimu, instant killed. There was also a time that I thought I was actually recording where I got there as Rimu, Rimu and I didn't really do that great, but I didn't get instant killed at least. Um, played everybody like I said, done this multiple times, blah blah blah. Let's try and make this one a win. It's not. I'm not going to beat the final boss, but I'm hoping to at least get there. This set of lives makes me pretty weak, and I'm going to play Mima because this is her final appearance in Toho Games. She's never seen again after this. I don't know why, but she just suddenly dis a freaking beers. Where's that? I think I've mentioned that shift lets you move slower. I don't use it. Um, I might need to use it in a later Toho, but that'll be that's a long ways from now. 
these things are annoying and I hate them all, so I will purge them. The objective here is to get through the first two stages without dying once. Will it happen? Likely not. You get extends less frequently in this Toho than you do in the other Tohos. I find this Toho to be the hardest out of the first five. Uh, out of the first five of them, the bosses are pretty rough. The game itself is pretty rough. There's less extends, like I've mentioned. It's just not as friendly. Mima's attack type is not does not work well with me. I'm not good with it, so we're gonna probably see me fail. So that's fun. I think I've run through everything I've wanted to say. I had a I had a recording where I thought everything was uh, peachy, hunky dory. Everything was pretty good. That was the Rimu one where I got to that final boss and all. And um, except I didn't have uh, Camtasia capturing audio. My bad. That was ruined and everything about it was always gone and ruined and I had to get rid of it. It was sadness. Cause I like it was it didn't even if it was if it would have just if it had at least recorded the game audio, I could have kept it. Could have done post commentary or no commentary at all didn't happen whatever <clears throat> we're here together that's all that matters we're playing as Mima for, <laughs> because I guess that's just how I feel like playing I like her bullets by the way Mima's bullets look awesome it's like da 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 it's awesome ah uh, haha Mima's gonna make this very challenging isn't it yeah Yuka actually serves uh, my purposes the best. I hug the back wall no matter what during Toho games, so Yuka's wide spreading shot is uh, probably the best for me. However, I didn't want to use it. Mima would probably be the best against bosses because her fire is more concentrated. Rimu is a good choice for any situation because she can deal out front fire and she has a homing attack, so she can kind of handle herself in any situations. Now I have translated stuff over here, because there's no English patch for this game, so I have translated stuff over here that I can read, so, hmm, I wonder who's over there. This is Mima speaking, again, honestly. Sarah's all like, oh, holy crap, you won't be allowed into Makai, and, well, I guess I'll have to get rid of you to get into Makai, then. I won't really, there's, in quotation says, not really, so, she doesn't really have to kill her to get into Makai, but she's gonna do it anyway. Um, anyway, I said you aren't allowed to enter. You're in my way. I'm no pushover. Yes, you are. You'll regret that. We'll find out if I'll regret anything. I'm Mima. I'm a, I'm a vengeful spirit. Here to kill people. Alright, are you gonna derp like you did every other time I fought you and shoot something backwards? I really hope you do, because it's kind of hilarious. Yep, she shot it backwards. <laughs> And she saw it sideways, so she derped, uh, yep, she's derping all over the place. You know, Sarah could actually pose a threat if she could shoot in the correct direction. <laughs> uh, she'll probably still kill me, though, because I'm making fun of her. I'm focusing. Focusing means I can't speak. Now, this is like the most worthless attack ever because uh, the lasers. Well, she didn't even get. I didn't even get a chance to show it, but the lasers don't keep going to you. Do you regret fighting me? Yes. Crying. <laughs> uh, she gets taught a horrible lesson. So what did we get? We got done with that. That was pretty easy. Uh, I usually don't die on the first first stage. The second stage, I might get killed by the boss or something else. Stage two, uh, the difficulty gets pretty bad pretty quick. First time I played here, I was very confused. I thought those uh, these falling things were part of the background at first, and I actually shot one, and I was just like, "Oh, what? Confusion ensues." Uh, that was what happened. It was all very, it was all very like laid back like that. So, we I can't even hit. I suck. Now with Mima, you know, you gotta keep fire on the people that you want to kill. That's the bad part about her. You have to actually move with them. With Rimu, since you have something always shooting someone, you don't really gotta worry about moving with it too much. Um, yeah, I was in a kind of a bad spot there. So stupid. Ah, mirror, oops. <laughs> mirror Angel. Let us duke it out. We'll fight with fervor. Zeal. Everything else that describes fighting. 
I can't tell what's going on. Oh, well, you're dead. Hey, my bomb got cut short. That pulls in power-ups automatically. It's kind of a useful thing whenever you don't want to get power-ups yourself. Now I'm not going to have that luxury. I missed all of that power-up. La 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 la. Oh, S. P's. P's again still uh, for power, and the purple things are still point blocks. Um, blues in this game give you max dreamscape. Let's see if I can catch it. Got it. Max dream bonus, whatever. That, uh, I think that just m modifies how many points you get. Like, it gives you more points or something. Uh, it's the bar above the power bar. Let's see if I can perfect this boss. Not get killed. I must be getting close. Looks like there's a guard here. Oh my, who are you, I wonder? You don't look human. I am. She's lying. But really? Oh, do you want to fight? Well, I suppose. Really? Well, don't hold back. Mima, you're letting yourself get flustered. Why? Yeah, this is probably going to get me killed. There's one move in particular, if I recall right, that just screws me. Other than that, that kind of screws me quite a bit, too. Uh, I'm waiting for it. This is not it, but this might still kill me. I'm getting a bit complacent. I'm getting complacent at my old age. There we go. This is not it either, but that in conjunction, in conjunction with something... There it is! And there's the, there's the combo of Doom. Now, with Rimu, I would still have had fire on it, which would have been nice. Ah, attack! Oh, I didn't even have to dodge. Mima does enough damage that I don't gotta dodge that. I wish I hadn't done that. What's with you? Yeah, Mima's just like, ugh. You asked for- you, you agree to a fight, and then you complain about it? Pfft, lame. What's with you? Huh? Loser. I don't know, not very good voices, honestly. Stage 3. If I get killed doing this, I'll be pissed. Okay. I was pulling something. I was pulling uh, my translations down. Okay. Dodged. Barely. That was stupid. Almost went into it. Uh, I'm gonna kill stuff. Killing, killing. Whoops! <laughs> I think I okay. I think you guys can tell what I tried to do there. I was trying to just go around, and I should have gone around, but um, I thought I moved up when I had it. <laughs> that was pretty epic. I was just like, dead, no chance in hell. Okay, saved my life this time. I think we saw that I wasn't gonna get out of that one alive. We got an extend. That makes up for that. Uh, I'll fly it directly into the bullet. That was a pretty good, uh, pretty good move. I gotta say, you know, they didn't see it coming. It threw them off. It, uh, it lowered their total concentration. Makes it easier for me to defeat them. <laughs> I remember there's a, there's a part in this game that I'm always impressed with myself. And it's not hard at all, so I don't understand why I'm always impressed with myself. But I think I know where that is. It's not until stage four. And it's like, it's not hard to dodge it at all, but I'm always so impressed when I do it. Extend. Catch. I have full power, so I don't actually need those. I need purples more. That's what I need. Missed the purple. Kill them! As Remove, this is so easy, because uh, the indirect fire, like the one that homes in on people, It'll shoot at whatever side you're not shooting at. 
it always does it for me at least. I don't know if it'll do it for you. It might not like you as much as it likes me. But it always shoots on the opposite side that I'm that I'm firing on, so I can just clear out both sides of those really easy. It's pretty nice. <laughs> Isn't there anyone stronger here? You've gone far enough. You're the one that's causing all the fuss around here, aren't you? Oh, such a belligerent attitude. You want to fight? Of course I do. I want to quiet you down. Well, shall we then? I won't forgive you for this. For what? She hasn't done anything yet. Yet. <laughs> Alright. Uh, you're Alice. Yeah, you're Alice. Alright, this is Alice. She, uh, in Toho, she makes dolls. And those two are dolls that are helping her. So, that kind of sucks, because they... I didn't move, because they add, uh, they add some extra firepower for her. I think we get to see her later on. I think she'll be, I think she'll be a reoccurring character. This is a sucky move. Ah! That's not good. I shouldn't be taking damage this early. I shouldn't be losing two lives already. That's terrible. now because I'm trying not to die again. That was close. I could have gone I could have gone awry. <laughs> that mirror attack's kinda sucky. I don't like it very much. Uh cheats. Oh I tried to move up and I went out of the way without, you know, screwing up and I didn't. Aha! Let's see if we can at least make it through this without dying. Um, like, without having to use the continue. <laughs> Alright, that's not gonna happen. Why is it so hard for me to do this? I did it so well before. I've always died on the Alice fight, but I've never, like, gotten killed this early, this fast, like, this many times. Essentially, is what I'm trying to say. Like, I find this to be a very rough boss fight, but I, you know, I usually do a lot better than what I am doing. There we go. Actually, no, two lives... Well, I lost three lives here. Two lives is about normal for this area for me. She's just sobbing. I don't know why it's so long whenever all of this is sobbing. Just what were you trying to accomplish? <laughs> no one could beat me. I'm Mima. <laughs> I'm a vengeful spirit of doom and decay. <laughs> Alright, let's see how quick it takes... Uh, let's, let's see how long it takes for me to get murdered. The background music for this stage is Forbidden Magic. Because they're using Naruto. See, they're, they're channeling Naruto as their magic source as they throw uh, Shuriken at me. So, where uh, where might I ask is Kakashi Sensei? Or he could probably help me navigate through this. Whoops, whoops, that's a Shuriken. <laughs> <laughs> Caught one. It's this part. I'm always so impressed with myself here, because I dodged through them so well, although you can't really tell, because they're dead. I think there's a part where it's a little bit harder. That doesn't actually seem what the one that I'm always impressed with. It, there's more there. Has to be. I don't know. I'm, I'm confused. Oh, frick. Oh, that sucks. Uh, chances for actually getting to the final boss? Uh, not that great. Ah! Damn the world! Damn the world! <laughs> Just give me all the purples. I want some extend. Hello there. Now this girl, she she wants to be a uh, Shemaru. She's one of the Toho characters, uh, and she does that like weird thing. At least she did a Nidori in Nidori's game. She did that, uh, like, fading, like, going back and forth thing real quick. Um, Aya in Toho is a reporter. She, like, pretty much interviews every character from Toho 6 and beyond. And she's deceptively strong because she accidentally beats people in fights when she doesn't mean to. So, you know, she's, she's, pretty, she's a pretty powerful character in the Toho series. And she just kind of like, hey, look at my camera. That's all she, <laughs> that's all she really does. It's kind of cool. She's one of my favorite characters.
Killing, killing, killing. Alright, we focused. We're, we're not doing horrible, I guess? I mean, we're doing pretty bad, but we're not doing... Like, usually I the place I extend the continue is at this boss fight that's upcoming. That's usually where my first continue is expended. Um, I've already expended that first continue, so we'll see where we get to from here. Alright, that's very not cool. I don't like it very much. Kill these things quickly. I didn't. I had to look down to see where the hell the bomb key was. Uh, I almost died for it, I'm sure. Here it is. This is the part that I'm always so impressed with myself in. Because there's there's one specific pattern that I've memorized, and which kind of undermines my impression of myself. How, however, I'm killing most of these, so there's no real need for pattern memorization, because they're all dying too quick. That's great. I always get really impressed with myself there, though, even though it's like the most ridiculously easy thing ever. It just looks it looks like it's, it would be hard, but it's just it's really easy. So there we go. I take the wind out of my own sails for me. I don't need you guys to do it. Yeah, dream bonus max. Uh, uh, eh. <laughs> I don't know why they give me a max dream bonus though, because I'm probably gonna lose it in the first 12 seconds of this boss fight. <sighs> What are we on, stage three? Uh, hmm, I think I'm getting tired. Maybe you should lay down. Welcome, Miss Visitor from Another Dimension. She says nothing. I'll lead you to a place where you can rest forever. I'm sorry, but I'm afraid I just came from that world. That's the reference that she's dead, but, you know, vengeful spirit comes back. And now this girl's like, what? I see. Well then. You see, that means I'll be the one to lead you there. You don't have to be afraid, Yuki. I'll be sure to beat her for you. My? You look ready to go. Yeah. My, let's get her. Okay. All right. Th these two are. This is like one of the first. This is the first boss battle where you have to fight two people at the same exact time. Simultaneous. I got panicky. I'd rather use bombs and die. Let's just be honest. Uh. Oh. Yeah, so you have to fight two people at once. Um, if Once you win this boss fight, whoever is alive regens their health and you fight them again. As, as, a, as a secondary boss fight. So, um, yeah, my cheats. So, keep that in mind. Um, they're both relatively the same, like, difficulty. Oh, crap. They're both the relatively the same difficulty in the follow-up fight. Now, Mai's laser really makes it hard for Mima to fight her to fight in this battle. Any other character has kind of like a... has some ways of dealing with it. Of compensating. Anyway. They're both relatively the same strength. Uh, it's probably more personal preference than anything. Who you want to fight. Uh, apparently I'm going to be fighting the person... Um, the other one. Which I didn't... I as, as Mima, it's better to fight Mai. Because the dialogue between them is much better. The, like, the dialogue between these two kind of sucks. Now, let me see this. Why, you... Sniffle. Alright, you've done it now. Now I'm serious. Alright, so this is gonna be pretty rough. Let's see if I can do this right. Actually, I think mine might be slightly easier than, than uh, Yuka. Yuki, whatever her name was. I don't recall. It's been a while. It's been like eight seconds. And by that, I mean like a minute and a half, probably. Up, oh, see that—that that is what happens. She can kind of get you just in a complete situation where you're screwed. I'm just gonna get rid of those. All right, I need to get back on focus here, so I have to spend another bomb. Up, 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 Oops. I hit the wall. <laughs> it's just bomb. I knew how, I knew uh, that we were getting to that section where... Oh, I, I had an opening. I didn't think I did. Sometimes you just, you don't really have an opening you can get to in time, so... 
I kind of figured I didn't have it at that point. I'll take you there, just like I promised. I'm sorry! After all, that other girl is waiting for you there. <laughs> it's great, because if you actually defeat Yuki first, Mai's like, Now the dead weight's gone, I'm gonna kick your ass. It's just pretty good. So now we have, uh, yeah, we got, a, we got a problem here. So stage five. This one features two boss fights as well. Two boss fights or one boss fight? I can't remember if the boss, if the final boss is just immediately after, or if the final boss is on stage six. Like if there's a stage six, I don't know. We'll find out in a bit. Yeah, it's definitely a stage six because I remember it being really hard, like not really hard to get through, but pretty rough to get through. This stage can be hard to get through, especially as Mima. It's much easier as Rimu because at least some of the people are getting wiped out. There'll be an area later where you'll see that this is extremely hard as Mima. Like, even now, I'm having a little bit of trouble getting over to shoot these things. Kill them anyway before they run. <laughs> More stabbies. Everybody wants to stab me. Nobody wants to just be like, I'm your friend. Why would they, right? I'm Mima. I mean, I understand that I was an evil character for a lot of games, but come on. You know, I should be respected at this point. I'm, I'm helping. I think. I'm taking care of a demon problem, or... Wait. What are, what are we fighting again? What are, What's coming out of Makai? Are they ghosts? Are they, yo are they yokai? What are they? Either way, they're not supposed to be here. We're dealing with them. I'm helping. <laughs> I helped. Okay, I can't get through this. I mean, I could, but I can't get through and do damage to people. Mid-stage boss. Nope. I'm probably gonna die. Go. Nope, here it is. This is, this is Death Town City area. Like, Mima cannot handle this. There's just too much people firing. She can't really uh, do much to it. Wait for it. It gets a little bit worse. There it is. Alright, I don't have any bombs remaining. Can't do that. Am I doing a good job? I can't tell. I'm watching, uh, I'm watching the bottom with me. I can't tell if I'm actually killing a lot of stuff or not. No, I, please don't get watery right now, I. I oh god, thank you. <laughs> but I started to get a little bit watery, and I was just like, oh, I'm gonna die, but no. Ah, it's okay, I died there. Blast! So you finally come. Who's there? I knew you would come. Then, what? where is this place? This is my world. <laughs> this is my world. So, what are you after? Lately, there have been an awful lot of beings from Akai in the human world. Since the human world is mine, I thought perhaps I should look into it. Oh, I'm sorry. I guess we forgot to give you proper warning. Next time, we won't forget. So, just who are you? Well, I... Lady Shinki! You don't need to tell someone like her. Her sins against Makai are many and deep. I won't forgive her. You, Miko. Well, I suppose if you say you won't forgive her. Da -da 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 -da. So I'll leave it to you. Certainly. Hmm. So it's okay for you to be violent. I'll cleanse you of your sins. I don't know. I just might commit a few more here. Hmm. -hmm. Alright, let's do this thing. Gonna expend my second continue here, uh, possibly my third. This uh, this is also uh, this is a hard enough battle that I might die that many times. Catch them! <laughs> I want to be under her. There you go. Oh crap! Oh crap! Yep, expending second continue. Up, oh, it's frick. <laughs> I don't know how I went through that, but that's okay. 
I'll take it. I'm not getting out of this alive, nope. Yeah, I'm probably gonna have to expend my third. So, we're not doing very great. Nope, stop. Just stop. Oh, by the way, Mima's bomb. Coolest looking bomb, I think. Maybe Yuka's might be a little bit better, but um, probably not. Again, I can't stay under her to do damage. She's just... Fuck. She's just stopping me continuously. It's not okay with me. This doesn't sit well with me. <laughs> I actually thought that this attack was, uh, this attack combination was, uh, the other lady's shit. Shinkies. Uh, I think if I just handle the situation as it needs to be handled. There we go. Yeah. Lady Shinki, I'm sorry. Well, I must say, I'm somewhat insulted that you put me on the same level as her. She's still crying. Kind of brutal. Mima's pretty, pretty big jerk. <sighs> Alright. Uh, I'm gonna show the final boss? That's about it. I can't beat her. I've tried. I even set myself to six lives as Rimu and I couldn't do it, so. I just can't beat this final boss. It's just. It's, uh, my skill level is just not good enough. And I'm totally accepted of that. I'm fine with it, in fact. I, I can accept that I suck at video games. Bomb this just to collect all of them. Got what I wanted. We got my extend. Are these following me? Aw, uh, Bloom! Frick! I didn't even move! Well, that was fun. Whee! Oh, I can't believe Yumiko lost. Show yourself. And Yumiko was among the strongest of my creations. But you were able to defeat her. Just who are you? So you created that other girl. Oh, pardon me. I'm the one who created Makai. That makes me Makai's god. So you see, Yumiko wasn't a golem or anything. She was just a normal inhabitant of Makai. Oh, I see. However, I'm the god of the human world. Lie. In any case, there are too many inhabit too many of the inhabitants of Makai entering the human world. I see. Well, feel free to do something about it if you defeat me. Hmm. Okay, in that case, I hope this can be fun for you. Hmm. I don't know if any I don't know if it'll be any fun for you though. Hmm. <laughs> you sure fool of yourself. Let's go. I don't know why I gave her a new voice, but I did. Alright. This is my death. This is my undoing. This is where instantaneous defeat occurs. I need to keep firing. Never let go of the button. Never give in. Never surrender. Open fire. Yeah. Frick. I went right into that. Oh, I've totally got this. She can't beat me. She's a weakling. Look at this power. Look at this power. Maybe, maybe Rimu was just, oh God, was just not the way to go. I've done more damage to her than I did as Rimu. <laughs> Pretty much. No, I, I got her down to about half health, but that was like all of my lives and a lot of continues, and it was just kind of ridiculous. So, I mean, Mima's, Mima's definitely doing more damage to her. Or maybe I'm just playing better as Mima. Nope! No way! I could have probably skirted that, but I didn't really want to. What's going on here? What crazy attack? What trickery? Mantle! Oh god, you have wings. Nope. Oh, I actually made it through that. I didn't think I did. Sweet. There's nothing I can do here. Except for dodge, kind of, I guess. Whoa, God! Ah, ah, the color scheme! It's terrible! <laughs> Why? <laughs> what, are, what are their attack ranges? I don't even care. Give me, give me an extend. Oh, There was a time I got an extend when I most needed it in a boss fight, and it was like, pretend- ow. Potentially the most amazing thing ever. Well, if that was the game, I could probably... It seems... See, now, like, that damage seems like I could actually do it with Mima on six lives. I... That's about... That's about how many... That's about how much damage I did with Rimu at six lives, so... 
like, I don't know, it seems like it would be possible, but I don't want to take the time to go and try it again, because I'm kind of, like, this is like my eighth time playing through while trying to record, so I don't really want to do... Three of them were actually good and almost there, just that the other five were... Bad things happen, so... I don't really want to try it again, I mean... Uh, you know what I mean? Just, eh, I, I guess I'll give it a try, but likely not gonna happen, so this is probably the end of the video. Um, Sorry that I can't show extra levels, uh, extra stages, because I can't no-continue this game. Sorry that I can't even beat her, gosh! But, you know, it's some of us just aren't as good at video games as some of you, so apologize for that. Hope you like, like, um, I hope you you watch this and are kind of like, I want to play that, and I hope you download it and play it, because that'd be pretty cool. You know, I'm trying to, I'm trying to get people to play these games. People who may not have ever seen them, or may not have ever, uh, really gotten into them, hoping that you guys, like, that those people see this and are like, okay, I kind of want to try that out, or I kind of want to give that another chance, or something and something. Because, I mean, if you're seeing me, who's terrible at video games, having fun playing a game that's out of his league, you know, hopefully, if you're, if you didn't do good the first time you played it, you're like, oh, I'll give it another shot. I mean, if this idiot can do it, I can do it too, you know? That's kind of what I'm hoping. So I'm hoping you guys play it, and uh, probably the end of the video, so... Come back for Toho number six, I guess. No more Mima. She's done with all Toho games now. She's not gonna ever come back unless uh, unless she's brought back in like the, a, a newer Toho. I don't even I don't even know. So whatever. Anyway, done. The game allows me to cheat and win, apparently. So let's go. I've, I still have to continue after this, so we'll see if we do better or worse. If we do worse. <laughs> If we do worse, that'll be sad. I already I died twice to the first boss, so I haven't been doing like fabulous or anything. Maybe it's because I'm like, oh, I'm up. Oh, well, there we go. Maybe it's because I feel like I'm really cheating. I, I really do. I feel like this is so cheap to set the lives to six to beat her. Oh, oh I went way too far. I overshot. <laughs> My bad. Come on, let's bring, let's do this. Fight me. There was no, there was no escape. I should have just bombed. All right, well, no. <laughs> let's play for reals, realsies. Ah, oh, that was sad. I flew right into it. This is hack, where you grow the mantle and you're like, Psh, Psh, that's right. What do I keep saying a mantle? It's wings. Look, there's, there's six wings. Oh, I tried to, tried to undercut and I failed. Dodge the yellow weird things. Dodge them all. Alright. This is where I died last time. Ouch. This is where it gets really hard, and there's probably no chance of me winning. Nope, not even going to play it. Ouch. At least now I have reset bombs. I think I'm going to lose to this. Frick, I didn't even get a chance. I failed. Oh, well, that was a lot better than the Remo run. <laughs> it's still sad. I used six lives and I still can't beat the final boss. It's just, it's, it's a little bit sad, a little bit depressing. Totally okay, though. We, we expect nothing higher from me. Um, yeah. Still, if you, you know, if you still haven't played these games, go do it. What is, what are these percentages? 10.26%, that makes me feel like I suck. <laughs> oh, um, there's actually something else I want to close on, so I better, I'll be right back. I'm going to check it. Uh, just, so, just give me a second. Because, uh, I want to, I want to start, 
say summarizing the story of the previous game at the beginning of the video, so then I wanna I wanna say like all the other people's past in the in the end. So I wanna talk about I wanna just run through uh, what Yuka was doing, what um what Marissa was doing, what Rima was doing, but I have to go read uh read their translated versions to see what they were doing, so hold on. Okay, so Remo, very, very straightforward, like always. You know, as it said in the prologue, just running around, stopping the demons from coming in, wrecking her shrine, all that jazz. Boring, boring, that's all she is. Marissa, she's running around, you know, just trying to beat people stronger than her. Yuka, Yuka is the fun one. Yuka is, is, is playing games, that's what Yuka is doing. She's having fun. She came to Makai to play. And one of the best lines ever is what I read, it's, um, j like, she just says, Genocide is just another game, it doesn't matter if it's humans or, if it's human residents or Makai residents, and it, it's, like, the best thing ever, because she says that right to Shinki's face, and Shinki's just like, you bitch, I made everything here, you don't say that about my people, it's, like, the best thing, and then she, uh, she makes a mistake of calling Yuka human, and Yuka's just like, oh, it's on now, snap, snap, power is everything. And that's it. So that's all they were doing. It's very the storylines for these ones are very simplistic and very non um like they aren't they don't really apply to other games. But I think in six through whatever number they're at now, um I think those storylines actually do kind of build on each other, if I recall correctly. I don't recall though, so whatever, that was anticlimactic. Um Yeah, so that's all that was happening, and that's all that did happen. Yuka may be the best. Yuka and Mima. This will be Mima's last appearance, like I said. Kind of sad. Bummer. I liked Mima. I do. Uh, but Yuka is hilarious just because Genocide's a game to her. <laughs> so I kind of regret not playing Yuka, but I, I'm glad I didn't. Her ship, her attack type is just not... I, I can't play that. That thing sucks. It's really weak against bosses. And, uh, yeah. So, there we go. Hope you guys come back for number six. Don't know when that'll be, but that's okay. You will still probably like it. No, you won't. It's gonna be terrible. I'll probably lose a whole lot. All right, off to other things to record. See ya. Bye. Have fun uh, doing whatever it is you're doing. Pick up Cherio and all that. <laughs>